Isn't this the most cutest thing ever? <gasps> oh my god. It is so cute. Yes, girl, I like to rest my head here. The blue little fake plants. So I found these cups and they seem really, really cute for like wine, even coffee. Ice coffee. Okay, Ikea, I see the vibes. Love it. Ooh, I do need a picture for you. Fun fact, I'm only in Ikea because I am waiting to go to a job interview. So we're just walking around because who doesn't like Ikea? You guys tell me, would you pay $24.99 for this? Don't even ask me to pronounce it. It's a basket. Ten of these. But like for the price though, Hmm. I don't know. $24.99 seems like a lot. Hmm. Where? That's the green, the pastels the wood and the little plants but they would be real ain't nobody buying this desk for $449 like excuse me me thought nope like not even this probably I really like this but what I'm really here for is the food. We need to find food. You know, most Ikeas that I've gone to, they have two stories where you can just either go upstairs to eat or go downstairs to go to the snack area and you actually have to walk this whole Ikea here in Round Rock in Texas. The most funniest thing I just saw so this lady opened this up and her face turned red because look, I'm dead. Thank you. I do need to update on these. Mine at the house are all moldy and icky, and I do use this a lot. This is a must have. OMG, IKEA house French presses. <sighs> Need or want? I'm gonna say it's a. Uh... Okay, it's kind of like a need, but mine's isn't really like old and icky, so it might be a want. Where is it now is the only question. I touch it and it's already like rocky. This kind of like moves. It's so cute. The thought of it is cute, but... Mm. We need to talk. You know, to everyone who wants to buy a bed in Ikea, just take the L, please. And if you're, if you're willing to buy an Ikea bed, just buy 
like a purple mattress or even the perfect cloud like not sponsored but the perfect cloud i've had for about five years and it's the best one that i've ever laid my head on and i got it for like 500 but this right here not the bop mm -mm. this is so cute my new my wife and i have been talking about getting a coat rack <gasps> I don't like the color, but this is really, 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 really cute. And it's temporarily unavailable. Boo. I am sad, everyone. We made it to the cafe and it's closed. Hmm. What happened? No! Oh my gosh! Boo! It is temporarily unavailable. <laughs> Shit. Hmm. I literally was like, let me get some meatballs, let me get some lingonberry sauce. Like, I gotta drown my sorrows and. I don't even know now. I don't know what I want to eat. You know, I've had one of these. The only thing is that they get kind of rusty. But it is pretty good for bang for your buck. Now, I don't suggest to use plastic on anything, so I wouldn't. And they only have these funnels in yellow. I sound like a Debbie Downer today, but I was so excited to come to Ikea. We are going to now be in the search for this French press to see how much it is. But how cute is this? It's even elevated. Like, this can even be for a plant. It doesn't even have to be to cut food. All right, Ikea. I see you, boo. For $20. I see you. I have like 35 of those in my house. Barely even use them. Now this is cute. This is extremely cute. The only thing is that for $5.99, I actually have a Cricut, so I can do the measurements myself. Let's keep going. French press. Where are you, French press? Mm. If it ain't stainless steel, I don't want them. Now, I think... Oh, stainless steel. I think, though, I don't know whether to get it at Ikea or at an Oriental Market, but I've been into bowels lately, and this is a steamer. <sighs> For how much, though? $20. Mm, probably. Let's put it in the bag. Alright, let's see what else we have. See, the stainless steel pots. Okay. Let's, let's talk about this. See how it's like complete? I don't know how many ply it is. But it should be three, which is stainless steel, aluminum, stainless steel. But for the price, it's a little heavy. I gotta do some research before buying it to see if it's really worth the money. 
You probably didn't even get to see, but it's fine. Mm -hmm. Your voice. actually have several of these where I put like my oats, my rice, quinoa. I don't see the French press. Oh look, cups. I got the two prettiest cups. So pretty. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <gasps> There's an additional OMG. OMG. Nice. Look at the vibes. <laughs> I'ma have to. I'ma have to. Oh, and they have coasters. <gasps> kind of feel like it's a little slippery. I like it. Is this plastic or glass? Hmm. I don't know. It's also a goblet. It's the goblet. Is this a goblet? Looks like a like an egg. Alright, I decided to take this one. Yep, this is the one that I'm taking. Oh, I'm in trouble. You see, I was supposed to be here to eat and now we're just spending money. Great. Okay, so PSA, do not come to Ikea. Just to spend time before you go to another job interview because my guy, I want everything and I'm here now taking my sweet time and I look down and I'm like, <gasps> I need to, I need to leave. So now we are just going to skip. <laughs> that means I have to come back again. But we're going to skip around. There's actually like some stuff that I really need to get. So I may just come to Ikea for funsies. Should I buy everything I need or should I leave? Goodbye. <gasps> Self checkout, self service areas. So, yeah. I'm trying to self check out, Kako. Oh my gosh, you guys. <sighs> when the summer comes, you guys will start to see my fascination with plants. <laughs> All my plants are done now. I take them home right now, they're all going to die. Yeah, girl, we got to do a little fast, yeah? So my next interview is at three in person. Let's keep it going. Call me a bad girl, but I left it. I left everything that we just got, only because I want to come back. Oh, what's this? I want to come back with more time because there are truly things that we need. We just moved to Texas and my apartment needs a lot of things. And so I just don't want to get here and there. So we're going to have some food. I'll just see what they got. As a bariatric patient, 
I can't really have any of this, but uh, we're gonna have to take the L on something because I'm hungry. Veggie dogs, no. I want my belly hurt to hurt. So let's see. They have cookie butter, two dollars. Yogurt, coffee. Mm. Okay. I guess I'll do a hot dog. No, not even. My stomach is going to hurt. This all looks pretty sad, so we're gonna take the L and just start. Okay, let's go. Pretty sure that they are not uh, maintenance people. They are dressed as cook cooks, so yeah. I'm very sorry if this is really low, but I'm not comfortable talking out loud. You see, this is <laughs> please. So everyone. Thank you for coming to me, well, coming with me to my IKEA adventure out in Round Rock, Texas. Now we've been, you know, let's keep it pushing to the interview. If you guys kind of like this, you know, I'm very simple, I'm very awkward, and I'm very shy. But my main reason of doing all of this is because. I don't know anyone in Texas and all of my friends are in Florida, friends and family and everyone are in Florida, not working just yet. I was supposed to take a hiatus and I'm like, no, so, oh, by the way, I'm a behavioral therapist for children with autism and I'm a student analyst to become a board certified analyst. So. I'm very awkward, I'm very shy in the beginning. Until you know me, then it's like woo woo, be woo woo. But let me know if you guys like this. Hit you a vlog.